It is a fight over fish pedicures. A Gilbert salon owner is suing the state so she can still offer people the pedicures. They involve fish eating dead skin off customers' feet. CBS 5's Sarah Buddison is downtown with the details on this one. Sarah. Catherine, the Goldwater Institute is taking the case to court for the spa owner. The lawyers here admit it sounds fishy, but they say it's worth preserving this kind of pedicure. Fish pedicures created a frenzy around the country last year. It's like having your feet in champagne. It doesn't hurt in any way. It tickles like hell, though. Gira Rufa fish, imported from China, eat dead skin off your feet, leaving them callous-free. I still have many phone calls asking for the free soap. To let Arizonans in on the treatment. This is a whole area here. Cindy Vong is this suing is the state. I want it back. I want my normal, you know, operation back. It just... We, I spend so much time, I spend so much money, and everybody loves it. The Arizona Cosmetology Board banned her from giving customers fish pedicures in April, saying the fish should be sterilized like tools, dipped in barbicide and dried under a UV lamp. The fish will die, so you can't you can do it. Cindy says the fish are clean and that Arizonans shouldn't be deprived of getting to put their smoothest foot forward. Southeast Asia, almost every country have it. Europe have it, Canada have it. It's just like the fish do not harm anybody. The lawyers here at the Goldwater Institute say the state doesn't have the right to regulate the fish or to stop Cindy from making money from fish pedicures, and that is why they took on the case. Live in Phoenix, Sarah Buddison, CBS 5 News. We'll keep watching this one, Sarah Thanks.